It was a massive win on the D-Day, where Congress won only at Telangana, while BJP swept in Rajasthan, Madhya Pradesh and Chhattisgarh. Both the BJP and the Congress had frame issues with the general elections in mind. The BJP, which had last year won Gujarat and Tripura, but suffered defeats in Karnataka and Himachal Pradesh, needs and needed victories under its belt to build momentum in its favour to run up the Lok Sabha polls. The Congress, on the other hand, is desperate to win and was desperate with a couple of states which it hoped would have given on the upper hand of the seat sharing talks with the allies of INDA bloc. The elections were crucial prelude to the Lok Sabha polls which are all set to happen next year. While Rajasthan, Madhya Pradesh and Telangana voted in a single phase, the elections in Chhattisgarh were held in two phases. The counting for all four states began with postal ballots being counted first after which the votes from electronic voting machines, EVMs, were counted. This is in Telangana where Congress won 65, HRS by 39, BJP 9, H by 4 and CPI for 1. The total for 118. While in Rajasthan, BJP was sweeping with 112, Congress with 71, BSP with 3, 3 with BHRTAD, VSIP, RLTP with 2, and Independent with 7. While in Madhya Pradesh, the BJP won with 159, Congress with 68, BSP with 2, and others with a total of 208. Seats. And now, while in Chhattisgarh, the BJP went up with 54, Congress with 34, GGP with 1, and CBI with 1. Total of 90 seats. Sahral TV Bureau Report.